Today I'm going to show you how to create a virtual disk on Windows 11. Go down to your search bar, we're going to just type in VHD down here, and we're going to click on create virtual disk. In here, as you can see, you should be able to see your drives. This is my games drive. This is my C drive. Up here, we're going to click on create vir uh, VHD. We're going to name it whatever we want. In here, we'll just name it test. Location, where do you want to put it? You can put it on your C drive, your games drive. In this case, for this sake, I'm going to put it on my desktop. We'll just hit select folder. This is the size of it. We're going to go to gigabytes. In my case, I'll just type in 5,000 gigabytes. That is five terabytes. The reason we do it here is because terabytes, for whatever reason, isn't working. We will not touch the VHDX. We will not take, we'll change, we'll keep this. So that way it can grow as you add more stuff. We're going to hit create. We will leave this as GPT. We're going to hit initialize. We will then give it a name. In this case, I'll just la label it as test. It does not need to be the same name as when you first made it. You can name it games2. You could name it uh, graphics. So uh, we could also label it as videos. Let's go with videos. Uh, for drive letter, name it whatever you want. So in this case, let's just pick M, right? We're gonna leave file system NTFS. This is the size. So 5,119,983 is five terabytes. Down here, we will not touch this, all right? Don't, don't touch this. So we don't even worry about advanced. We're gonna hit click format. Now, if you look, we got our C drive, we got our games drive, and we got our virtual hard disk. And it's just labeled as videos with our drive letter. We will then close. If you come over here to your file explorer, it's right here. You want to add something to it, you just move it over. You want it, you know, and then you can close, and then you can right click, hit eject, it's no longer there. To open that folder back up, you just double click it. Oh, there's your item, right? And then, boom, we're all done.